Welcome to the video on multiplying and dividing by powers of 10. We're going to start with multiplying uh, and I'll just talk about what powers of 10 are. Okay, if we have 10 to the power of 1, that's 10. 10 to the power of 2, that means 10 times 10 or 10 times itself twice, that's 100. 10 to the power of 3, that's 10 times 10 times 10, 1,000. 10 to the power of 4, 10 times 10 times 10 times 10, 10,000. So whenever we're multiplying a number by a power of 10, we're shifting the decimal place to the right, okay? That's that way, all right? That way. Uh, if it, it is shifted, the same number of zeros in the multiple. So let's look at the first one here, 6.3 times 10. Now this is the multiple here. How many zeros are there in this number? There is one zero, it's right there, okay? So that means we're gonna shift the decimal place one spot to the right, okay? So it's gonna do a bunny hop like this, comes up and over, okay? So our answer now is 63.0, okay? We insert zeros um, if necessary, all right? Now it's not heaps necessary to write it as 63.0, but I'll have just to show you that we've moved the decimal spot from there, done one bunny hop straight to there. If we have 0 0.042 times 100, we're looking at the multiple. Here there's two zeros, which means we're going to shift the decimal place two places to the right. Okay, so we do one bunny hop, two bunny hops. Okay, the decimal place is here. So the answer to this one is 4.2. All right, we shifted it two spots. That was our answer. We didn't need to insert any zeros there. Over here we have 3.2 times 1,000. Okay, now we're going to need to insert a few zeros here. So I'm going to just write it like this for now, 3.2 with a couple of zeros there, just so you can see what's going on. And there's four zeros in 10,000. One, two, three, four. So we have to shift the decimal place four spots. Okay, so let's go. We got one, two, three, four. The decimal place is gonna be there which means before the decimal place, we have 32, one, two, three. Okay, that's 32,000. I like to put um, commas to separate three digits at a time. All right, so our answer for this one is 32,000. And we'll put the decimal place there just to show that we shifted it three spots. Now, whenever we're dividing by powers of 10, we do the opposite, okay? And that is we shift it in the opposite direction. We shift it to the left rather than to the right, okay? Left is that way. So if we have 0 0.32 divided by 100, we're going to be shifting this decimal place to the left, okay? And we shift it, again, the same number of zeros in the multiple. So in 100, there's two zeros. So for this one here, I'm just going to put a few more zeros in here, and then we have uh, 0 0.32, all right? We're shifting this two spots, because there's two zeros here, two spots to the left. So we're going like this, one, two, two bunny hops. So it's gonna be there. So what we're gonna have is we're gonna just include one zero at the front. We're gonna have 0 0.0032. And that's our answer for the first one here. If we look at B, we've got two, uh, 278 divided by 10,000. So 278, you're going, hang on, well, where's the decimal place for that? Well, actually, all whole numbers have decimals, okay? So we can put a decimal there, and there could be a zero there. It's not going to be heaps necessary. What we're doing is we're shifting it one, two, three. We're shifting it four places. So we're actually going to need to add a zero here, okay? So we can go like this, one, two, three, four. The decimal place is now here. So our answer, and I'm going to put a zero in front of it, just for a technicality. So the answer for this one is going to be 0 0.0278, okay? 278 divided by 10,000, 0 0.0278. Okay, this one's going to be nice and easy. 2.72 divided by 10, okay? There's only one zero here, which means we're shifting the decimal place one spot to the left, okay? So the answer for this one is going there, and we'll just put a zero in front of it, 0 0.272. Okay, so in summary, if you're multiplying by a power of 10, you shift it to the right that many zeros. If you're dividing by a power of 10, you shift it to the left that many zeros.